GTA fans rejoice. Well, hopefully you get to rejoice. And uh, we've had rumors and speculation uh, for the last year or more talking about remakes or remasters, uh, even classic remakes of the PS2 era Grand Theft titles. And uh, these rumors, uh, they swirl. Well, now Kotaku is reporting uh, that they have three different sources that say uh, that GTA remasters are currently... Uh, in the final stage. And according to the sources from Kotaku, this is Grand Theft Auto 3, Grand Theft Auto Vice City, and yes, Grand Theft Auto San Andreas. And the alleged rumor is, it's not confirmed by Rockstar or Take-Two Interactive, is that all three games are being remastered using the Unreal Engine, and they will be a mix of old and new graphics. I don't really understand what that means because the old graphics wouldn't look right with the new graphics at all but i'm sure rockstar knows what they're doing so i'm sure it'll be fine one of the sources even said they saw some of the games in action and those visuals reminded them of a heavily modded version of classic gta so we'll have to wait and see they say the ui for the games is going to be updated but it will retain that same classic gta style i don't know what do you guys think what would you pay for a trilogy, if they bundled all three together, I don't know, they may uh, release these one at a time and then you have GTA 5 enhanced on the current gen and then we get GTA 6 in 2030, I don't know. But if they were kind and they bundled them all together and you could buy the GTA remastered trilogy, including 3, including Vice City, and including San Andreas, what would you pay for that? You let me know in the comment section. I have a feeling people would shell out a premium AAA price for that. Matter of fact, I know they would. And the internet's probably going to break if this comes true. And the rumor or the article states that it's going to be coming to Switch as well. We know it'll be on PS5. We know it would be on the Xbox Series console. But apparently, it's actually going to be on the Switch. Now, I don't know exactly how the Switch would handle that. But we'll have to wait and see. But that is the current rumor. Nothing about GTA 6. It's We're going backwards. Instead of going forward, uh, we're just going to go back. Now, the question is, what is the roadmap of releasing these titles? Will it be one a year, or will they drop the, the absolute just mega video bomb and give us the trilogy together? I hope they give us the trilogy together. Now, these are games we've already gotten. These are games we've already experienced. So, to space them out, I don't know. I mean, worst case scenario, you have to buy each one individually and they're spaced out over six months or a year and they're AAA price, which I highly, highly doubt. Best case scenario, it's one bundle for like $59 or $69 or $79. I'm pretty sure people would pay $79.99 to get the entire trilogy remastered bundle. I'm pretty, I, I don't know, maybe I'm wrong. You guys let me know what you think. But that is the current news. And if Kotaku's reporting it, it's going to get interesting, honestly.